Today I'll be talking about enabling your microphone or camera. If it accidentally gets disabled for some reason, you just installed the app, like let's say Zoom, and you try opening a session, and for some reason you realize that it gives you this warning message. So I'm gonna show you two ways that you can go into camera or microphone and enable it. The most obvious one is the one that's displayed in the error message for your app. So today I'm going to be doing Zoom. So it says to go into settings, privacy and camera. So I'll go ahead and do that. Go into settings. Scroll down to privacy. Doing it this way is kind of uh, convenient because then you can enable all of the apps that you want to do it all at once if you actually, for some reason, disable a bunch of apps. So I'm going to go into privacy and then scroll to either the camera or microphone. These are the two most common things that get disabled without you even knowing it because the first time the app opens, it asks you really quickly, do you want to allow location services or do you want to add, allow microphone or camera? So if I go into microphone, I disabled it for Zoom and you can see you can easily enable it just by clicking on this. But I'm gonna leave it disabled I'm going to go back over into camera and show you here that you can enable. You can see over here in Zoom, enable, disable. The other way of doing it is to go back into settings. And instead of going to privacy, scroll down all the way down to the app itself. So I'm looking for Zoom. And instead, I can just go straight here to Zoom where it has notifications and other things, i.e. microphone setting and camera setting. And from here, I can enable it or disable it. So I'm just going to enable, enable. And now the microphone and camera are enabled for Zoom. So those are the two ways you can do it. You can either go through privacy settings and then select the setting you want to enable or disable by selecting by finding the app itself or in settings you can just go directly to the app by scrolling to the very bottom and find the app and select it and then enable either whatever setting you want to enable or disable if you want to enable it should turn green and the little toggle should be to the right so thought that might be useful but uh I'm sure it's easy to figure out on your own.